afternoon from the CBS 19 newsroom. I'm Jillian Sheridan. Two bodies found in Longview today. The first this morning when a man was found dead in a home in the 500 block of Jones Street. Police say he had a gunshot wound. No arrests have been made. The second body was found this afternoon near the Cargill Long Park walking trail. Police say it appears to be a homeless man who'd been there in the woods for a while. Klein Animal Shelter Executive Director Angela Wallace is arrested on several charges. Jacksonville police arrested her at the shelter around 10 o'clock this morning. She's charged with assault, animal cruelty, and illegal euthanasia. Police say more charges are expected before the end of the day, and the department also has warrants out for former employees of the shelter. A pretrial hearing for capital murder suspect Jonathan Ray Shepard is scheduled for next Tuesday in the 115th District Court. 32-year-old Shepard is charged with shooting his son's mother, 29-year-old Cheyenne Green of Gilmer, in the Gilmer High School parking lot during a junior high football game in 2013. Police identify the woman killed in a car crash yesterday on Highway 31. 47-year-old Julie Patrick of Tyler was headed east when witnesses say she suddenly veered into the westbound lane. She was hit head-on by an 18-wheeler. Well, we've got some beautiful weather in East Texas today. Hope you have some outdoor plans for the weekend. We'll take a look at our warm forecast. All that plus sports coming up tonight on CBS 19 News at 5, 6, and 10.